Yeah, I mean, I think, uh, you know, coming in in the first season, um, you know, we just want to be way more competitive game to game, uh, way more competitive day to day. Um, you know, we certainly want to be, uh, in, in terms of the long term of the season, we want to be, uh, you know, in the pack playoff hunt. Um, I think we, you know, phrase it to the team. Uh, if we get to the last week of the season, last two matches, uh, and, and we control our destiny, that's, that's where we want to be. Um, so that every game's meaningful, and I think that's a good, good first step in the right direction for season one. Yeah, so I mean, um, the soccer program here, and I've been pretty transparent with our, with our recruits and the, and the new guys coming in, um, hasn't had you know, any measure of success in, in recent seasons. Um, so, you know, coming in, you certainly expect there to be, you know, whatever word you want to put on it, rebuild, retool. Um, I think the talent level from the returning group is a lot higher than people would expect. Um, I think we have a lot of you know guys that are all conference caliber type players, um, and they just need it a, a better a better structure in terms of the program, um, both in the day to the day and then the structure on the field. Um, and I think we've added to that with you know a really talented freshman group that comes from uh, recruiting a little bit more nationally now. So a freshman group that comes from Arizona and Colorado and Florida and Brazil, and um, and we really want to get. Uh, our competitive depth um, to where it needs to be where you know every day we have two three guys compete for each spot on the field yeah so we do kind of like a mentor system um, done at previous schools as well uh, so each of the upperclassmen gets one of the incoming guys and uh, they pretty much take them under their wing so they're their you know their resource for questions both on um, the soccer end of things anything from our team structure you know positional responsibilities all the way into the academic nature, you know, getting it, getting into week one right now, and just that the, the time balance aspect of, of academics with soccer, and um, so we, we we match guys up, and um, it, it's usually a pretty good system, and they, you know, they, they develop good relationships, and it helps break down some class walls as well, because um, you always have that a little bit, you know, you're always a little bit tighter with with the guys in your class, um, but we want, you know, a cohesive cohesive unit of 32 guys as well. Yeah, no, I think um, I've almost had to temper excitement, right? You know, I think the guys, uh, even in our scrimmages, they're so amped up in the first, you know, 8, 10, 12 minutes of the match that um, we're, like, losing some of our defensive structure we put in, some of our attacking structure we put in, just some of the, uh, the staples of how we want to play. So I think, um, if anything, you know, our coaches and uh, staff, we have to keep a more even keel mentality um, and just keep these guys focused on the task at hand um, because I don't think – there's going to be any issue tomorrow and throughout the course of the season with energy level and competitiveness. I think that's just a lot of excitement for kind of a new era of St. Vincent soccer for sure.